Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, remember to subscribe and hit that like button. Um, so for today, we will be talking about how to install a plugin and how it works. Uh, specifically, what we're going to be using today is the plugin Appointment Hour Booking for WordPress. So let's get on with the video. So the first thing that you're going to want to do is just go to WordPress. Once you're logged in, you'll obviously see your dashboard. Um, you're going to go down to plugins. Normally, um, I know for most people, they already have like their plugins right at the top, right next to the like the menu, I guess you'd say in a way for the plugins. I don't have it for some odd reason. So I have to go to my sites, network, and go to plugins. Oops. Go to plugins. And then what I do is I just go to add new there. Since mine isn't on the main path. Anyway, and then you're just gonna search the plugin that you are wanting to get. For me, that is network hour booking. So, and then there it is right here. I already have mine activated, but you would just press like the install, install now button. So yeah, so let's go back to our plugins now that I already have it installed. And I'm going to just press, make sure that it's active. So I'm just going to go down to here where it says appointment hour booking. There, and then right here, it'll kind of bring you up to, it's sort of like a weird like area or so. But anyway, uh, that's what it looks like. So now what we're gonna do is I'm going to press edit because it comes as a default for you. So on here, so after that, it will bring you to here, like the edit form wise. So on here you can go and you can change things and add like certain times and stuff like that. The ones that are grayed out, you have to pay for. For the upgrade version, I just have the free version. Um, and then over here, it will kind of like show you what it will look like. So that will be October. They will choose the date that they want to schedule you with. So I'm going to go ahead and add a single line for a name, a purse, a place for people to put their name at. So I'm going to go and put the name in the field area, make it large text because some people's names are long and I'm not gonna have a minimal character length or maximum just because some people's names are longer than others. And that's pretty much all. And then you can add like a different appointment like services. I think you can add as many as you want. I haven't had any issues with the maximum or minimum. So, and then I'm just going to name my form booking service for trout films. And then you can also add a des description like, hey, this website is so you can place a booking with with me. Check it out. Just something sort of like random in a way. But yeah. So that's pretty much all. And then you always just gotta make sure that you save your changes because you don't want to lose everything that you've done. And then after that, you pretty much, that's pretty much it. I mean, here's the part where you can do like your add-ons. And then reports. Um, so it's 
yeah. And then you can also add like a verification, like a, I don't know how you pronounce it. It's like verification, make sure you're not a robot kind of thing. But yeah, and then you just save and publish it. And then where you would find it is, for me, I'm just adding it to my post, my booking form service. But you can also, these are the other options that you have. This one, I know pay, you have to pay, and then I think all the other ones you don't. But, and then you can also change the name for the form one, and then just publish. So, yeah, it's pretty easy to use. I really like it. It's very fun and stuff. And you can also add other calendar names and you can do other ones too. Or you can clone it and schedule and see which ones are where, what kind of bookings you have. And then it'll also email you like uh, confirmations on if you have any bookings, which I thought was really nice too. So yeah. Well, that's all for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I will talk to you guys very soon. Mm, bye.